Hi scholars. Now I know normally when we have theater class we have warm-ups so I thought why not bring some warm-ups to you all at your house. So we're going to do the typical warm-ups that we do during drama class to get our body ready for some acting. The first thing we're going to start out with is our shake it off. Shake it off, shake it off. So we're going to remember you do one hand at a time. We're going to shake to eight and go all the way down to one. Ready? And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Two, three. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, one. One, one. Shake hey, it off. Oh, get all that tension out of your body. Your body becomes loose. It feels good. Good. Okay, so let's do some quick circles shoulders, get rid of any tension we might feel. If we've been looking down at our computer a lot, this is a great way to ah, release those, that tension. Okay, let's do a quick isolation with our shoulders. Ready? Follow me. One, two, up, up, down, down, both up, both down, both up, both down. Forward, forward, back, back, forward, forward, back, back, both forward, both back, both forward, both back. Circle back, circle back, circle back, circle back, circle forward, circle forward, circle forward, circle forward, then side, 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 side. Do a little shake, have a little fun. Great. Ah, okay. Now moving on to our diaphragm. Remember we talked about the diaphragm helped pull, push the air out of our lungs to go over our vocal cords so we can project our voices nicely. We want, when we're acting, we want to be loud, but not scream. And projection, remember that means to speak loudly, is how we do that without hurting our throat. We use that diaphragm. When you do this exercise, your hand should be moving. So we're gonna push the air out through our diaphragm with a ha, he, hi, ho, hoo. Ready? And ha, 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 he, 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 hi, 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 ho, 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 hoo, 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 hoo. Okay, good. Now you can always do that longer if you want to, but I just did it shortly for that. Okay, now after we do that, let's do a quick wah, face movement, massage your face a little bit. You're going to look silly, but that's okay because we want our mouth to be ready for our next exercise because we want to be able to articulate when we speak. Remember, articulate means to speak clearly, and enunciate means to use all of the consonants in the word so that we can understand the words you say. So to do that, we do tongue twisters because that works out our facial muscles and our tongue, as well as our teeth, to speak clearly. So uh, I'd like for you to repeat the tongue twisters after me. Here we go. She sells seashells by the seashore. She sells seashells by the seashore. A big black bug bit a big black bear. And the big black bear bled black blood. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. How many pickled peppers did Peter Piper pick? Which which switch the sandwich? Which switch which which switch the sandwich? You'll typically make some mistakes like Miss Cheryl did. And we'll do a few more together. Toy boat, toy boat, toy boat, toy boat. And to close it up, unique New York. Unique New York. Unique New York. Okay, so there was our warm up. Um, I'd like to do a challenge for you all. I would love for you all to try to create your own tongue twisters and teach your family, as well as the ones that we've done on uh, this video, 
But remember, when you make a tongue twister, you use the same first letter in all the words, like big black bunk, or she sells seashells. So try to think of many words that start with the same letter and put them together, and boom, you have a tongue twister. So I hope you take time throughout your days to do these warm ups, if nothing else, to just have a nice brain break and get your body moving. Okay. Oh, and before I forget, make sure when you come up with that tongue twister, put it on the specials email. That specials email is peakspecials at gmail.com. Again, that's peakspecials at gmail.com. Hopefully, we might be able to share some of the ideas that you came up with.